His Excellency the President has directed that all public offices, including civil service and parastatals, purchase Kenyan-made furniture and other associated items so as to support the growth of the manufacturing industry and enhance employment creation. The government is the biggest spender in our country, and this directive will ensure that half a billion shillings, that's 500 million, will be pumped into the local economy. Government officials are encouraged to buy high-quality furniture and other locally made items directly from Juakali artisans, manufacturers, and shops, and to avoid using middlemen who inflate the costs of the items. It is important that taxpayers' money be used diligently and value for money achieved. In addition, in a bid to enhance efficiency, transparency, and to reduce corruption, the President has also directed that government offices adopt open space type configuration. This will encourage sharing of resources and enable all officers to be aware of all the transactions being undertaken in public offices. The Head of Public Service has issued circulars to this effect and no exceptions to the rules will be allowed. And finally, the government is keen to ensure that the country gets a new constitution as per the set schedule. Therefore, His Excellency the President has stopped all ministers and assistant ministers from travel across outside the country so as to allow them to be available for parliamentary debate on the draft constitution. These directives take effect immediately. Kolugia Kswili nukisema ya kwamba Rais Mwai Kibaki ya miamuru ya kwamba kwanzia hivi sasa serikali na ofizote za serikali ziweze kunua meza na bidhaa zingine za kutumiwa kwenye ofisi kama meza, viti kutoka hapa nchini ziwe zimetengenezwa hapa nchini amesema hii ni njia moja ya kuongeza hali ya mapato kwa wafanyikazi wanaofanya kazi hapa nchini haswa wale wanaounda uh, bidhaa tofauti haswa wale wa jua kali na pia najua kwamba shilingi zaidi ya karibia nusu bilioni zitaweza kutumika hapa katika nchini ili kuwapa watu kazi pia rais wake ameamuru kwamba ofisi zote za serikali kuanzia hivi sasa zinazojengwa na zingine zibomolewe ziwe katika ile inaitwa open space ya kwamba kila mtu anakaa katika meza ambayo kila mtu anamuona sio kujifungia kwa ofisi hii inamaanisha kwamba mtu yote anahusika katika hali ya ufisadi ama kufanya tabia zingine mbaya kwenye ofisi ataweza kuonekana na kujulikana ndio ndio kila mtu aweze kufanya kazi ambayo inafaa na pia matumizi ya zile bidhaa za ofisi kama ni printer na zingine ziweze kutumika kwa watu wengi Rais Moi Kibaki pia na serikali ingependelea sana tuweze kupata katiba mpya kulingana na vile tumeweka ile ratiba ya kupata katiba mpya. Kwa hivyo Rais Kibaki amesimamisha ziara za ngambo za mawaziri na manibu wa mawaziri kuanzia hivi sasa ndio waweze kuwa katika nchi yetu na waweze kuenda bunge na kuweza kushirikiana katika ile hali ya majadiliano kwenye bunge ya kuimarisha hali ya kupata sheria hizi mpya.